is going on YouTube today we are doing something totally different we are riding the new 2019 Can-Am Riker 900 <laughs> I'm about it. All right, we're in sport mode. Whole lot of gang shit. I'm gonna show you guys some features on it. First of all, boom. Oh, okay, I just... Put your feet up off the ground. <laughs> I told you. Hey, I said one. I told... That was your one. That was boring, too. You could have done it out on the open road. And away more. Let's get it, Chris. Me and my boy Chris here doing the, the Can-Am Spider Riker demo day. We out here. I don't know what to expect with this thing. So it's an automatic CVT clutch transmission set up meaning no shifting necessary just twist throttle and go pretty sweet thing slid out a little bit my man chris has been at the uh, dealership selling bikes for like 10 years definitely an og look at him <laughs> oh that's funny oh man looking gangster with it <laughs> All right, we can't both fit in the lane. He's gotta go first. <sighs> Woo! Hey, this thing's got some little pull to it. So they make uh, Sea-Doo jet skis. If you don't know, Can-Am puts the Can-Am motors in the uh, Sea-Doo jet skis, vice versa, and jet ski motors in the Can-Ams. But they make a Sea-Doo Spark, which is a smaller version of uh, all the other jet skis that they make and it has a smaller motor in, in turn this one has a smaller motor as well being the uh the spark engine Woo! yeah we gotta rip it one time you feel me But this little clip right here lets you adjust the bars on the fly. The pegs flip up. So you can adjust the pegs and the bars to your preference instantaneously. Damn, this thing rips. I think it's pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. So I got sport and eco mode. I went ahead and did the, uh, the sport mode. The cool thing about this thing is it's about $8,500 starting and it goes up to $10,000 for the rally mode which is going to give you better suspension, a couple other features and whatnot. But uh, in spider talk, that's crazy good. I'm going to kill that squirrel. It has just a bunch of special little features on it that make it more of a premium thing. But uh, the biggest thing with it is the fact that it's like three times cheaper than the normal spider prices, which is pretty nice.
It's just about, uh, I think it's a tad bit wider than the, uh, the F3 models and the RT, it's slightly uh, less wide. Oh, we're just whipping in this neighborhood here. I don't think we're supposed to, but it's all good. This is it's just a quick little test ride on it. It's got some nice pickup though. I like the, it definitely feels more torquey than horsepower, but as you guys tell, we, we hit 90, no problem. Reverse, you got this little shift lever right here. It's gonna click it up. Click it up, I think. I think, oh no, you just do something. Yeah, they mad. <laughs> they definitely mad. <laughs> oh man, Chris Iyer, tearing shit up. Whole lot of gangs. I like this guy way more now. Yeah, super simple controls, turn signal, high beam, low beam, horn, everything else. How the fuck? You said with the hand? Yeah. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> well man chris all right so the gas tank it's super super simple you just slide that forward it's got a little funnel so you can use the actual gas can or regular gas pump um let me click that forward super simple uh mirrors controls are very easy and simplistic like i said you can adjust the bars on the fly bada bing bada boom these pegs pop right up slide them back boom so you get your little four foot girlfriend on after you it's super easy now the uh, passenger setup is going to be a possibility and basically it's all going to be flush so the passenger pegs are saying they're going to tuck in under here you got a flip seat passenger sits right there overall though i think it's pretty cool it's definitely uh, obviously not the specific bike that i'm into but for what it's worth it <laughs> it's a fun little bike i would definitely ride one if uh, i had one all right but yeah that's going to wrap it up uh so 2019 can-am spider Riker and this is definitely uh, aiming towards the younger demographic you can tell all these little plastics right here you can adjust and uh, change out to different colors they're gonna have limited color schemes coming out so once they make these certain plastics the limited ones once they sell out they're not gonna have any more or anything like that so it's gonna be a cool little new market of people that this is gonna be attracting to and the tires spin out so i approve all right guys hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to like comment subscribe and like always keep it dank Later. One, two, three, four, five, six, That's really nice.